What's happening, everybody? Mark Mude checking in on behalf of Billy Go Gruff and the Rock Billy Red Devils. Going to do a demonstration and discussion today about one of the Billy Go Gruff songs, Just Dance. It's going to be on the A Simpler Time album. I'm going to demonstrate it, and then I'll discuss it, how it came about, where it's at, where I think it will go, and uh, we'll see what happens. You ready? Here we go. so far I mean I could kept playing I was making it up as I go in along anyways the general idea of the song is this riff here <laughs> everything else I make up as I go along the little intro there with the uh, I came up with that just as I was playing it Kind of messed it up a little bit i make a lot of mistakes when i play everybody does <clears throat> don't be fooled by studio magic these guys in the studio they fix every little mistake and they sound like they're expert level guitar players mm, drummers and bass players and not so much you know that, that stuff gets fixed even live albums they go back and fix before they put that out these videos i'm not fixing you know that's how i do and I want this stuff to be authentic. I want it to be genuine. So you get what you get. Anyways, this song, I like it. It's live. It's jumping. It's got a, it's got a, it's got a nice bounce to it. It's got a little jump to it. <clears throat> kind of reminds me of the uh, Barrel House Blues bars, the uh, you know the roadside juke joints in the south. I don't think I will uh, change the song very much. I have about half of the lyrics written, but you don't get those today. When I, when I finish writing the lyrics, I'll tighten up the song a little bit and, and make another video, but I don't think I'm gonna change very much of it. I like that it sounds very live, very, very upbeat. And I think if I add a whole lot of structure to the parts, you know, and do this part here and that part there, and this one here, <clears throat> I think that takes away from some of the appeal of the live feel to it. That's what I like about the song. Uh, it came about, I was practicing some slide guitar, or slide notes, I wasn't playing with a slide, uh, I was practicing slide notes. Maybe I'll add slide to it, that might help make it even janglier sounding. All the open strings and the slides, the, slided, the sliding into the notes, that's a very expressive guitar technique. And then you got the bent notes, there's a lot of bent notes in there, and that's, that's also very expressive. Adds a lot to the song, I think. It's a very open, open uh, feel to that song. 
I'm playing along with just a few tracks. Uh, I recorded a bass line. It's, the whole song takes place in the key of E. Follows 12 bar progression, which in this instance is uh, E to A, back to E to B, and then it repeats itself after that. Uh, but it's a standard walking bass line. I put an extra click in there for the percussive edge up, but I'll explain that some more here in a minute. And it just repeats that. I have a uh, guitar track that follows that exact same bass line with the extra clicks in it. And then I also recorded just one little pass of clicks. A very percussive piece because I can't play drums and guitar and bass all at the same time. Oh my God, how cool would it be if I could do that? That's right. Anyways, before I get carried away, yeah, in place of the drums, I went on ahead and put some clicks in there. That's good enough to get an idea of how the song goes. And then I can hear <clears throat> what other types of things can happen in there. But I think, I don't, I don't see a whole lot of change coming to this song. I like the one bass, maybe just one guitar, one vocal, and drums. I don't see, maybe, maybe I'll do some slide guitar in there. Uh... Maybe a harmonica. I don't know. Leave some comments. Offer up some ideas. I, I might try. I'll try something. You don't know. I could do that. Anyways, Mark Mude, on behalf of Billy Go Gruff and the Rock of Billy Red Devils, thanks so much for paying attention, for showing interest in what this is, what I'm doing here. I really appreciate it. You can like the video. You can share the video, we can leave comments, we can talk about stuff. I love to talk. I do. Subscribe to my channel, ring my bell, get notifications. I'm uploading quite a few videos pretty quickly. But more than all of that, thanks so much for watching. See you in the next video.